Welcome to the intro video for the new business for Commercial Lines course. We are happy you are here and want to start by giving an overview of what to expect from both this course and this video. First, think of the different EasyLinks products as puzzle pieces. Now, think of the new business for Commercial Lines procedure as the completed puzzle. This course will take you through the steps on how to complete the procedure. In doing so, you'll learn how the puzzle pieces make the puzzle an efficient and easy process. This intro or checklist video will help you confirm you have everything you need before diving into the rest of the videos, which will cover the steps on how to complete the procedure. This will allow you to confidently learn knowing you and your account are prepared to take the first step to master easy links. We will cover the different products that will be used to learn the process and make it as easy as possible. Don't worry, if you don't have all these products, we will mention if there are alternate routes available. These alternate routes will make completing the task possible but might not be as efficient so please keep that in mind. While covering each product, we will review any tasks we recommend completing to help make the process as streamlined as possible. Please note that some of these tasks can be completed by everyone in the agency, while some tasks can only be completed by the agency admin. To help follow along, we've created a physical checklist you can print out to mark off which products you do have and which tasks you have or have not completed. This will help you in later videos to know when you should follow the product route or the alternate route. To find this checklist, hover over the support icon. Then, click on Support Center. This is where you can find full screen versions of our help articles. Using the search bar, type in New Business for Commercial Lines Checklist. Then, click on the article in question. Next, right click on the white section of the page. Then, click Print. This will print the browser page, so you'll see everything you see on your screen. Continue through the printing process respective to the web browser you are using. Now that you have the checklist printed, let's get started. The first EasyLinks product on our checklist is the management system. With this product you can increase your ability to retain current business while gaining new business. Your certificates, quotes, policies, and documents are all kept in one place saving time and making it easier to remarket. To know if you have this product, hover over the applicant icon and you will see an option to create commercial applicant. Now, the first setup task for admins and the most important is to set up your management system carriers. This list will populate what you must choose from when using products like Submission Center, creating manual policies and effects downloads. Hover over the settings gear. Then click on Manage Carriers and Markets. Next, click on Add New Master Company. And from here click on the master company. A pop-up will appear for you to select the writing company. You should receive a list of writing companies from the carrier. When finished click save. You must add the master company for every carrier you write with. To learn more about adding carriers please watch our video, Adding Carriers to the Management System Master List. The second EasyLinks product on our checklist is Sales Center. With our Sales Center product you can assign opportunities, import leads for prospecting, manage producers and processes, and set up automated events with ability to expand using Automation Center workflows. To know if you have this product, you will see the Sales Center icon. To know if you have prospecting to import leads, click on Prospecting and you will see an option for File Imports. If your agency doesn't have Sales Center, we recommend either the import feature for existing customers or the create a commercial applicant feature for new customers as an alternate route. Now, with Sales Center, it's a good idea to create a CSV of potential customers or leads, especially if you have our Sales Center product. Sales Center allows you to seamlessly import a CSV of leads directly into EasyLinks via prospecting. Once imported, you can leverage email campaigns to send bulk campaigns to leads in an effort to capture new business. Even if you don't have Sales Center, having a list of potential customers to input into EasyLinks is a great help. To get the CSV, click on Add New List and a pop-up will appear. In the pop-up click on Click Here to download the approved CSV template. Now you can add the information about your prospects into the CSV so you will be able to upload them into EasyLinks. Please note, if you do not have Sales Center with prospecting you will need to add your prospect manually by hovering over the applicant's icon and then click Create Commercial Applicant. Next, this section is specifically for Sales Center admins, as they're the only one with access to Sales Center settings. 
Within Sales Center settings, admins can set up user permissions and automated events, assign new opportunities, and manage producers and processes. To get to the settings, hover over the Sales Center icon and click on Settings. This will land you in the new Opportunity Management settings. Here you can determine how opportunities are assigned and viewed. Additionally, you can set how automated events are handled along with color coding each producer. The next tab is Process Management. Here you decide if a status will be displayed and define where the status belongs. If you need more information on Sales Center settings, please watch our Sales Center Setup and Settings video. The third EasyLinks product on our checklist is Submission Center. Submission Center helps track and organize submissions for commercial applicants to carriers. This is an easy guide for the process to make sure nothing falls through the cracks. To know if you have this product, you will see a Submissions tab on Commercial Applicants. Without Submissions Center, you will have to create commercial applications in the management system manually. Next, Submission Center settings can only be accessed by a Submission Center admin. To get to Submission Center settings, hover over the applicant icon and click on Submission Center. From here click on the Carriers tab. The list to the left will prefill the same carriers from the Manage Carriers and Markets list. You can set preferred carriers, add underwriters, and add producer codes. The next Submission Center settings tab is Threshold. Here you can set the number of days the system should start to consider a submission without a quote. To learn more about Submission Center settings please watch Submission Center for Admins, Submission Center Settings. The fourth EasyLinks product on our checklist is Communication Center. More specifically, you'll want to have email campaigns enabled and configured. With our email campaigns product, you can bulk email your customers or you can send a single email campaign to a select few customers. Using email campaigns in combination with our reports feature also allows you to build well-defined recipient reports and send targeted marketing messages. To know if you have this product, hover over the Communication Center icon and you will see email campaigns. If your agency doesn't have Communication Center or email campaigns, we recommend using the one-off email feature as an alternate route. Within EasyLink's Communication Center product, you can create an email campaign template. Essentially, the system will trigger the personalized email campaign template to be sent to leads based on a timeline of your choosing. This allows you to capture new business with the click of a button. Email campaigns can easily be used in conjunction with our Sales Center product to ensure your agency is exhausting all potential leads. To set up an email template for email campaigns, hover over the Communication Center icon and click Templates. On this page, you will see the system-generated EasyLinks templates and any other templates created. Click on Create New Template to the top right to begin. Here you can enter whatever you want for your email template then save. Please note, the checkbox which allows you to share the template with sub-agencies if need be. If you would like to learn more about email campaigns, please watch our video, How to Create Email Campaign Templates. The fifth EasyLinks product on our checklist is the Gmail add-on, Outlook plugin or add-in, which is part of Communication Center as well. These features help create a bridge between your email and EasyLinks. You can easily save all emails and attachments between clients in EasyLinks for a clear audit trail of communication in one place. Without the plugin you can export emails manually, then upload into EasyLinks. To know if you have this product, you must have Communication Center. Next, our Communication Center product also includes several features that can help you manage and store all your emails in EasyLinks. We highly recommend using one of these features which includes our Gmail add-on, Outlook plugin, or Outlook add-in to establish a transparent record of communication. You can easily add EasyLinks for Gmail from the Google Workspace Marketplace, while the Outlook add-in is available for Office 365 users through the add-in for Outlook Store. Please note that our plugin is only compatible with the desktop version of Outlook and requires a download link from EasyLinks. To learn more on how to add EasyLinks for Gmail, please refer to our EasyLinks for Gmail article. If you are interested in adding the Outlook add-in or plugin, watch how to install and use the EasyLinks for Outlook add-in or how to install and use Outlook plugin respectfully. The sixth item on the checklist is our accounting product. This allows you to track commissions, create invoices, manage receivables and payables all in one place. We also integrate with QuickBooks. To know if you have this product, you will see the accounting icon. 
Without our accounting product, you will have to manage finances outside of EasyLinks. Next is accounting settings. These settings are only available to accounting admins. To access accounting settings, hover over the accounting icon and click on configuration. Here you have access to add payee, line item types, accounts, edit account user permissions and system settings for accounting. Check out our accounting, setup and settings and managing payees and billing companies videos to learn more. Finally, the last item is client center. With Client Center you can safely share documents with clients. Additionally, clients have access to Client Center 24-7 and can view their policy, print policy documents, submit change requests like adding new holders to certificates of insurance and view their certificates. To know if you have this product, when you are on an applicant's account you will see the Client Center icon. Without Client Center you can email clients directly or call to help with policy documents and certificates. Next, we have Client Center Settings. These settings can only be accessed by a Client Center admin. To access, hover over the Settings gear and click on Client Center. Here you have general settings for address, display options, and task scheduling. Next, you have email notification preferences to select who should receive certain notifications. Additionally, we have certificates which are most important for commercial. Here you can set what certificates forms can be shared and carrier permissions. Finally, we have branding which gives you the ability to change the look of client center to better match your business. That is all for this tutorial, you should now have the knowledge about what items and tasks to complete before attempting to quote and bind for commercial lines. Thanks for watching.